Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I will take you around the gigantic engine room of the ship. The engine room also called as the heart of the ship is where all the machineries are controlled. Right now we are sitting in the engine control room which controls all the automation and control center for major machineries available on board. We will watch how an engine room of a gigantic ship looks like. We have two main engines and a lot of lot of main auxiliary machineries that you will see with me today. So without wasting any time, let's get started. So before starting the round of engine room, let me give you a tour of the engine control room. This is the place where we control most of our machineries as I might have mentioned in the starting. So let me show you what it looks like actually. So the moment we enter our engine room, we have a beautiful, beautiful table where everybody sits for coffee. Then we have a coffee machine, a refrigerator inside here where we keep some of our cold drinks, milk and other stuff. So these are the walkie talkie sets. Here we have some cups. As you can see that every person has a P-Touch around his cup like 4E for 4th engineer, 3E for 3rd engineer, CE is for chief engineer by the way, <laughs> don't mess with this cup. So these are the places where we just wash our cups and keep it. Here we have two coffee machines for a delightful coffee in between work and here we have one TT table but we are not using it for now. This is a very special thing. This is a couch where engineers sleep in the night. Yes, sometimes we just come around after night rounds and have a sleep here. So it is easy for us to access all the alarms. Here you can see some information displayed on posters. Now the machinery part starts here. You can see all these machineries and we can control everything on the ship from here. So. Let me just show you a quick review about how a ship looks like from the inside. So here you can see mostly panels which display various information about different parts of the machinery. Then here we have some world map and important chart diagrams for the ship so we know what is actually going where. We have different kinds of diagram depicting different machineries and systems on board. This is our printing areas. These are some of the cupboards where we keep our stuff. And yes, this is an important part of the engine room. So it says third engineer Yash. So everybody has their own. These are the EMFs that we use because outside the engine room, it is quite noisy. So we wear this and guys, please don't confuse these for headphones. These are not headphones. These are just some air protection for ourselves so that we do not become deaf by continuously working in the noisy engine rooms and here we keep our helmets some manuals and here we have a big screen depicting all the major machinery parts about the main engine and its parameters so we can have a look and see if anything is wrong this is the chief engineer's chair nobody sits here and then this is the workstation of the second engineer. He is the one who is delegating the jobs to everybody. And this is the cadet's chair. He is just sitting here and filling some documentation. So yeah, these, this was pretty much it about the engine room and some local control panels which I showed you. We also have some monitors where you can see different, different uh, images <laughs> which might be difficult for you to understand at first. But these are just the systems that we are ha having on board and various pipeline diagrams and other necessary information for the working. So this was pretty much it, the engine control room area. So this is where we come for just checking around. And from here, that is the entry to the engine room. And from there, we will go inside and have a look around all the machineries that are present. So before going to the engine control room, just make sure that you take with you the ear protection and the helmet so that you are safe all the time on board. So, oh, this is my, say, third engineer. 
so i will wear this this has an additional ear protection and a helmet itself so i will wear this go around the engine room and give you a tour get ready <laughs>